Hey everybody, welcome back to another edition of Survival Minecraft with JPT. Ah, oh, I didn't make it. Look what we found here. Found ourselves a witch's hut. First one I've ever seen in game, so let's go check her out. I'm actually on the hunt for leather. Could really use some leather and some other applications. Don't really think I've ever gone this far. What direction is this? East? On my map before. Don't even, can't really even tell if it's night or day, so I know to approach these with caution. Yeah, this is just out there, isn't it? Just out in the swamp. Swampy swamp swamp. Let's see here. Do I have anything in my inventory that's going to help us get up? Uh, just wool, I guess. I guess we can use wool. Um, let's see here. I'll put it there. And, um, I guess do it this way. Oh, nice. I didn't realize those were going to be, oh, bleh, 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 uh, 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 oh, drowning. My worst fear, by the way. Oh, I didn't realize those were going to be connected textures. That's cool. I've never seen that before. Um, let's do it like that. Don't do me like that. Well, how am I going to get up here? I guess I'll just break this. <laughs> Witch, I'm coming in. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. Um, I guess I'll just take your cauldron. <laughs> and your table. And your awful, awful decorations. Well, I wasn't really sure what to expect there, so I guess I'm really not that disappointed. No, I need the wool. Got some ideas for that in the future. Um, yeah, let's get rid of that one first. And then this one. Oops, and then that one. I'm just going to stand on it. It goes a lot quicker. All right. So again, I'm on... What the heck? You guys see that, right? The flowing water? That's strange. Oh, weird. Air pocket much? Oh, that is uber weird. Huh. <laughs> JPT is Aquaman. Do, 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 do. Yeah, that's a weird. It's gotta be a glitch, right? Or is this ice? Oh, that is freaky deaky. Ooh. Nice. Clay. As if we need any more. I'll wait. <laughs> cool. There's lots of clay over here. Duly noted. All right, which direction are we headed now? West. That's right. So in today's episode, pretty much done with the hotel, except for some, you know, minor details. We've been working on that enough, so I figure we would just uh, work on another building today. I think we're going to work on perhaps the bordello, otherwise known as a brothel, cat house, knocking shop. That's right. Um, House of Ill Repew. <laughs> and I think they also used to call them strumpet houses. I think I've heard that term before. Not exactly sure what a strumpet is, but I'm kind of afraid to even know, you know? So, yeah, we'll be working on that stuff today. At least the, ooh, pff, the early stages of it. I'm not meaning to, like, explode those things. I was just wanting the tops of them. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, interesting. <laughs> that could be fun later on. I'll remember that. Let's see, how do I mark this? Let's do the tallest sugar cane ever to remember. 
Oh, is it not going to let me put it down? Hmm. Curious. Is it because it's ice? Yeah. It's because there's ice right there. Got to break the ice. But wasn't it growing with ice next to it? Weird. Oh, it's... Can, oh, I guess you can't walk through it, so you can't step on it. Um, whatever. <laughs> I'll just leave it there. I'll try to remember. Maybe we can go down there. Have some fun. So, uh, some updates. was able to get my webcam working. And maybe by the time you see this video, you may have seen me in the flesh. I mean, I know there's other ways for me to record videos for you to see me. But... Um, I've been looking at some software, and I know that there are some pieces of software that you can, of course, sync up your webcam with you playing. And I'd like to do that, but I'd also not like to pay like 40 to $50 every year for a license. And there's a particular piece of software that is, uh, is all about that stuff. And you know what? I'm not so much. I'm not so much. So uh, if you guys know of any other software out there that is a little bit more inexpensive that will allow me to record and also uh, record my webcam and kind of sync those two together, that would be great. Um, pretty sure Open Broadcaster is one of them, but I'm not streaming. I'm not going to be you know, using Twitch or anything. I do have a Twitch account, and that is something I plan on doing in the future. But right now, I don't think the computer I'm using can handle all of that. Right now, I am recording this using Fraps, which I was totally happy paying the $30, $35 for. It has worked well for me so far. I hear some bones. Oops. Hui! Nope. 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 All right. All right, buddy. You jerk. Oh, yeah. Oh, really? And that was my last arrow, of course. Dun, 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 dun. Ah, oh, he saw me. Doodle -doo, doo Why am I not taking much damage? <laughs> it's because it's in my face. Oh, boy. Dun, 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 dun. No arrows, really. Let's get him to come out. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Ha! <laughs> gotcha. Don't mess with me, boy. So, anyways, what I was saying was, I, you know, I've used Fraps. Fraps has worked out for me quite a bit. So, you know, I'm not gonna really, you know, run away from that. Um, let me see. Just. Let me see what before I make the announcement of the wrong thing. There, I mean, there are there's there's just software, and I know what it is, and you probably know what it is too. And um, you know, maybe by the time the year is up, I won't be so like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I just paid that much money for another piece of recording software, and then just will you know be willing to pay for it again. Um, my big thing is I just oh really? There's lava over here. When since when has there been lava over here? Huh. Huh. I never knew that. I've never run into that, and I've done plenty of running around here before. Ah! <laughs> Very cool. Still no cows, though. It's becoming nighttime. This is not good. This is not good. Survival Minecraft at its finest. I'm pretty sure that's where my house is, right over there. In that general direction. Hui. So, like I was saying, how are you? <laughs> um, anyways, I've got my webcam working. That's the big thing. Is I got my webcam working. I've got one of those old Logitech something something four thousands. Used to be a used to be a great webcam back in the day. Uh, still is not the greatest quality. I am in the market for a webcam, but right now I do not want to spend all of my money on a webcam when I could be saving it up to purchase some better. Oh, there it is. I see it right over there. Some bigger and better uh, computer components to make a better computer. So 
Uh, webcam will probably be the lowest priority on that list, uh, mainly because I don't think this computer could handle its new GUI webcamness anyways. So uh, there may or may not be some opportunities for you to see me on webcam. So just uh, just keep that in mind. Just keep that in mind. But if you know some ways for me to, uh, you know, easily integrate, you know, myself into some of my videos, let me know. But uh, yeah, Open Broadcaster, I'm pretty sure is free. It's a very cool piece of software, but uh, I don't know. I don't think my computer plays with it very nice. Do, 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 do. And uh, I have, ooh, some lag there. I have been... Um, Anyways, the problem with the webcam, as I zone out there, the problem with my webcam before was that, um, oh yeah, we've got lots of food over here. So let me, let me take most of this with me. Uh, you can keep the seeds. I don't care about those. Um, I'm going to keep that steak. I got plenty of steak. Carrots I'll take with me and I'll also take apples. Okay, so that's empty. Go ahead and take that with me as I sort it to death, which clearly is not working. What is this? I was like, what is this chest made out of? Um, I will take a saddle with me because you just never know. I'll take the gunpowder as well. I'll take the string. Let's see, power. I think I'm ready for a bow with some power on it. Sharpness, looting. I think I'm ready for that sword as well. Okay. So let's head back over to the homestead. Yes, I hear you, kitty. As the chunks are loading. Give it a few seconds. Anywho, the problem with my webcam, as I finally get to that story, was that I'm running Windows 7. Logitech did not make drivers that supported this for Windows 7. So what you have to do, and this might work for some of you out there with old webcams that are running Windows 7 that for some reason it can't find the software or it's not supported. What I did was is I downloaded the drivers for Windows Vista. Yeah, Windows Vista, right? That wonderful operating system. Um, and what I did was I right clicked on the executable and went to properties. And then I selected something to do with cat uh, compatibility and I told it to run in Vista as compatibility mode. And then I also told it to run as administrator, which is like a little option that you can select below that. So with that, I was able to actually install the webcam and Skype was able to use it and see it. Nobody in there. Okay, that's what I figured. So that has been pretty fun. Rolling up on our town here. Let's go in here, actually. Let me store some of this stuff away. So now I'm able to use my webcam, at least on Skype. So I'm pretty happy about that. Not even really used it on Skype. I was able just to test it, though. And I was pretty pumped. So there is that. All right. Let's organize some of this stuff. I have done a lot of organizing here back at the general store. I've been moving a lot of stuff over here. So that's been really helpful. Let's see. Chicken comes before the at. Uh, put that in there, put the shrooms in there, uh, don't do drugs kids, and let's see, gunpowder goes in there, wool I'm pretty sure still goes up upstairs for some strange reason, I'm still doing that, string I believe goes in here, could use some more arrows, so let's go ahead and let's make that many. And I still don't have a birch tree for this stupid thing on the front. Oh, well. All right. Let's make ourselves some arrows. So, yeah. A lot of fun so far. I've been having a lot of fun. Um, been doing a lot of reflecting about what I want to keep doing here and not doing on this uh, this particular map. I'm pretty much down at this moment, as of this recording, I'm pretty much down to... Oh, wait, that's those look so much alike. Oh, yeah, I forgot I had a bunch of trees in here, too. 
Yeah, I knew we had some in here. Okay. I don't, I don't know why I just did that. Uh, we'll put a saddle in there too. Pretty much down to just timber and stone and this Minecraft series. Um, I've got an idea for another Minecraft series, and you may be seeing that as of right now. But I'm just going to have to settle on that. It's an, it's an interesting idea. I just don't know how cool it can be. That's the thing. Like, do I want this to be cool or do I want this to be really cool? And right now it's just kind of cool. At least in my opinion. So I've been, I'm just going to keep sitting on it. Let's go up here. So sorry there's not a lot of building going on in this episode. I just wanted to play a little bit of catch up. Let you know what's going on. Yeah, there's absolutely no wool up here. That's strange. Hmm, I guess I used it for all those beds. I do want to show you something real quick. But the main reason I may be just sitting on that uh, that Minecraft series seat, uh, four beds. So this is for like a gang of guys that just really want some place to stay at night. This is the real shady room. And then I put two beds in here. And then there's your double or your king size bed. And then there's your single for the lonely cowboy. So again, all the keys up on the walls there. No one's staying here yet. This is all my sandstone stiff. These hallways need some artwork. That's all I know. You got a single bed in there, and you got a single bed in there. So lonely. The other reason why is I, I want to put some, some paintings up, because some of the paintings in this te particular texture pack are very, very cute. All right. Everything's pretty much out of the saloon now, in terms of the goods. I have pretty much vacated everything out of here. Still need to put the artwork back up on these two, so that's exactly why I need to find more cows. I may just have to uh, migrate the cows over there, finally. May have to build a little bit of a ranchero, or a ranch, and get that stuff over there. Still haven't named the dog. <laughs> it's just dog. What up, dog? Dog, 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 dog. He loves me. You want a steak? Oh, there you go, boy. Good boy. Alrighty, so let's see. <laughs> He's still, I saw a little heart. You still love me? He still really loves me. He still really loves me. <laughs> no, you can't have the leather. You can't have the leather. So let's see here. How much wood do we have? I don't know what kind of wood I want to build this, uh, this uh, bordello out of. Do I want to make it out of bricks? No, I don't want to make it out of bricks because it's right next to the bank. I don't want to make it out of sandstone. I don't want to make it out of those because I've already used those for the shares. Um, don't want to make it out of these because that's just, you know, a fortress. Um, do we have a lot of jungle? Let's let's go take a look. I'm thinking birch for some reason right now. Just because it's kind of... Or is this all made of it? Yeah, this whole thing is made out of birch. So we might have to go with jungle wood with lighter accents. That is what I'm thinking. And of course I have a lot of jungle wood there and I have a jungle wood tree that I can go cut down. So perhaps we will go do that. Oh yeah, we got lots of jungle wood. Oh, look at that. That's ridiculous. We got 54. <laughs> this is... Um, am I going to use jungle wood for anything? No, as a decoration, no. Okay, wow, that's a lot of jungle wood. That is more jungle wood than a boy can ever imagine. I hate it when it does that. Why doesn't it switch those? Grr. So yeah, we've got lots of jungle wood there. So that might be enough to actually get something going over here. I need to think about this for a second, though. I need to think about this for a second. So I need to figure out how wide this is going to be. It's going to be somewhat comparable to the hotel, if not maybe a little slicker, you know, slimmer, slicker. <laughs> it's going to be slick. Hopefully it is. Um, so let me, let me sit here for a second and think about this. So I will be right back. 
All right, I'm back. I think I've got an idea for this. So basically we'd have like a window here, two doors here. Um, let's see, a window, window here. And then, yeah, so either here or here will be the end of it. I just, I'm not quite sure yet, but essentially Two double doors here. It's going to be a, probably a real long building. Probably about as long as this. If not, maybe a little bit longer. Long and skinny. And I think what I'll do is... Um, over here is we'll have maybe like a stairwell that goes up this way. Up to the top. So they're kind of separated. Um, but for now, we need to get to sleep. So let me go and sleep. We'll figure it out. I'm running into a little bit of lag, and I'm not exactly sure why. Um, wait, no. <laughs> That's not where our bed is. Our bed is right here. Sleep. There we go. I always seem like I have to click that bed twice, and I don't know why. It always freaks me out. Minecraft is about the only... Th the Minecraft and uh, Fraps, the only thing I'm running right now, so... Mm, excuse me. I don't know what uh, I don't know what's going on there. In the market for a new desk chair, by the way. New computer chair. This one is just murdering me in multiple ways. Um, it's a director's chair. You know, those things that you see like on uh, Hollywood movie sets. And it wasn't really ever supposed to be my main chair, but has kind of turned out to be that. All right, so let's see. Oh, I need to eat. And then let's get some of this down here all. Okay, so let's see. Let's see. So this should be the front of the building, or should we maybe go back and start it here? I'm going to start it here, just because I can. Mm-hmm. So that's where the door opening will be. Yeah. I think this is what it's going to look like. And let's not go all the way back. Let's try to make this work. I kind of want to share the wall with the bank a little bit. I don't know why. I kind of want to not... Although I don't think that would work. Because it's going to be taller than that. So let's see here... How many is this? One, two, oop, oop, slow down, buddy. One, two, it's hard to tell. One, two, three, f I can't even tell. I'm just gonna do it with the sand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. It is not odd. Um, always highly encourage people to use odd numbers. I don't have an ax either, do I? Shoot. Um, and the main reason for that is um, it helps with symmetry, but it also helps with non-symmetry at the same time. Whereas when you make everything even, it just really doesn't help. So um, I think instead of making this 12, I'm going to make it 11. I'm going to try to make that work. So this would be 11. Which is plenty, I think. My cat's trying to uh, be a part of this video. Go away, buddy. Get. Yeah, I know. I'm such a terrible person. Alright, so that's roughly the area that we're going to be working with for this. I don't know, is this big enough? I wanted to say it's not, now that I look at it. Yeah, it needs to be bigger. <laughs> it must be bigger. I just said it. It's probably going to be longer than this thing. All right, I got to get an axe. I know we have some iron in here. Ah. How to not open doors with JPT. All right, no idea where my iron is. I think it's over here, actually. Yep. Oh, we need to smelt that. Wee. Uh, we've got plenty of that, so we're good there. 
Awesome. All right, and that goes there. And that goes there. No idea how long I've been recording. But that's all right. I'm having a good time. Hopefully you are as well. The longer Minecraft videos take a lot longer to render. That's all I'm going to say. That's why I can't wait to get another computer. Because this one, uh, you know, it's, it's older. It's doing a great job so far. I appreciate having it, but... Sometimes I wish it could just render faster. I get a lot more done. I just leave it alone, usually overnight, and when I wake up in the morning, it's done. It takes about two and a half hours for a 35, 40 minute video, and that's not good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yep, that's fine. 15 works. It's just a little bit longer than that. That's fine. That's fine. Is it, though? <laughs> uh, but is it? Jason wonders. Hmm. Honestly, I feel like it needs to be too wider. It needs to go doot, doot. Um, let's see. So we would have a window here instead. Let me pick these up. Don't need these anymore. Basically, I want, even if it's a single door in the middle, I'm not going to worry about it too much. I just know that I need a window. So it's like a window here on each side, then a door here. Then a window here. Let's see. Because I need rooms. That's the thing. Bordellos are full of rooms for, for certain things. For lonely cowboys. Let's see. So then that would be there. So, a window there, a door there. Because basically, a, a room would be about this big. Which most people would say is enough. <laughs> and I would kind of actually want to agree with that. I would kind of want to agree with that. So, for the... For the meaningfulness of symmetry, we'll just we'll keep it like this. So then I just need two on this side. So really, that is where I need to build that. Don't want this building to get out of hand. I think maybe in the next episode we'll go caving. Just for some fun. And supply gathering. I think that's uh, that's going to be the plan for the next episode. All right. Um, general store. Need to get some more wood. Come on now, go down. And I think those were oak wood slabs for the floor. That should be plenty. Sixty-four, surely. Don't call me Shirley. Let me see how long I've been recording, okay? I'm going to be right back. Okay, just 29 minutes, so I don't feel too bad. Normally these episodes go about 35 minutes on average, so we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Woo! Thought I almost had it. A little good pattern going on there. And we'll do that, and yeah, just just for now. We'll see. that This might change. This could change. So, like, we've got three here, just two here, and three here, but, you know, it helps keep it looking a little bit different. 
And so let's see here. Can I not get that? Oh, that's crap. I know I can get that. There we go. So it's essentially going to be... I'm really thinking just as tall as, as that, perhaps. It just depends on... Uh, just depends on certain things. So let's see here. Let's do that. And then the windows essentially will be like so. Just as tall as the door. And go like this. Yeah, I was like, that does have two on each side, right? Yes, it does. And... I'll have a window there, I think, perhaps. And let's see here. Maybe a window there. I'm just mapping these out. So basically every two is what I'm thinking. And we can make work. And yeah, that might work. That might work. And no windows on the back. Most most Western buildings don't really have that, so unless I really feel obliged, I'll keep this the way it is. And of course, no windows on this side. Just because this isn't really lit well in the back here so I can watch my back I got some torches so if you guys got any ideas for buildings or maybe uh, things that I should be implementing in this world let me know I am uh, curious to see what you guys think I'm loving it so far I'm having a lot of fun Hope you're having a lot of fun watching me have fun. Is that the whole point, right? It's kind of the whole point. So this building will be more than just, um, you know, just the jungle wood. I'll probably implement a different floor for the, uh, for the balcony. For the balcony. There will be a balcony for the ladies to do what they do. Uh, let's see... Probably will need to go cut down some more trees. Because I don't think I've got enough wood. I think I'm going to use these, actually. Yeah, I think I need more spruce. And I don't need jungle. Oh, we got plenty of birch. So maybe the porch will be made out of birch with spruce logs like this for the supports. Because I used these supports here, but this is going to be a little bit older and a little bit cheaper to build. Um, actually, I think I'm going to do it here. I think that's where I'm going to build the uh, the porch there. For some reason, I'm just feeling this more than the other thing. Oops! Oh, you got a uh, you got an axe, buddy. Use it. So kind of like that, with supports. So I'll have one, um, I think I'll have one here, 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 and here. Going up there. So let me go cut those down. Actually, let me take a nap. Let's take a nap in the jail. Let's see what a night in the jail feels like. Oop, I see that skeleton up there. I see you. There's probably going to be a creeper in here. Explosion. Nothing in there. So we'll go sleep here. Alright, I am back and my computer's being a big old D bag. Big old D bag. <laughs> you know, I have to sing everything. You know that, right? Like that's just in my soul. Just just makes me feel better. <laughs> uh I think I cut it down just enough of these. 
Basically, I would like take two steps, and my computer would go. It's like, shut up, stop doing that. So annoying. Ah, that might be too much. That might be too much. But it's different than that, and that's what I'm going for. So the only other thing I might do is I might actually end up using uh, maybe oak planks. I don't know, it just looks too substantial, but if that looks too substantial, then this is surely not going to look any better, right? Let's try it out. Let's try it out. So let's see. Yeah, I mean, what's the difference? Not a whole lot. So, you know what? I'm just going to go with my original instinct, and we're going to try these out. And if it doesn't look right, then it doesn't look right. And we'll change them later. So let's just go with these. I need a door. So let's go ahead and build a door. Yoink. I could build four doors in seven years ago. Actually, I will need lots of doors. So give me those doors anyways. We'll need them for later. Oh, that's four scores. Never mind. <laughs> Four doors and seven years ago. Um, we'll put it on the front like that. So it's not going to be a very nice looking building. It's going to be nice, as nice as it needs to be nice. Does that make sense? Probably not, but that's okay. Alright, and then we will do... Do we dare go out this far... I think so. And these will be our stairs to go up. Now, do we have any stairs? No, we don't. Do I want to try to build it out of these? These would be some pretty long stairs. Let's see. Let's do that for now. So then as you go up, you go up like this. Fairly narrow. They're ladies, I think. You know, ladies don't need to be stepping up too much on their stairs. Yeah, we'll do that. As I gulp real loud. Hope, hope that didn't sound gross to you. And, of course, we'll need to put a ledge in. You know, goes around like this. <laughs> Oops. Uh, let's see... So, so I would I just had this random thought. This is the fun side of town. That is going to be the somewhat business side of town because banks, banks are fun. If you have lots of money, they're fun. So you got the hotel, you've got the saloon, you got the bordello, you got the bank. So yeah, lots of fun. Oops, we'll fix that later. Not too concerned about it at the moment. I thought maybe that hole wasn't filled. Yikes. <laughs> That's what she said. Oh, appropriate. Let's see here. Maybe we'll put windows on the back. Maybe even a door for quick escape. For certain situations. That might make more sense. Right now though, it's just all about the construction. <laughs> By the way, the other day, eh, maybe last week, maybe it's been longer than that, I don't know, helped a friend, or helped a friend take down another friend's shed. He had this uh, sort of, eh, not a shed, it was like a, like a, it was a playhouse, but it was made out of sort of a, your typical storage shed. But he had put sort of a loft area in it. Uh, it was made out of this really, th like the paneling was like an inch and a thick. It's like a soundproof uh, playhouse, which, I mean, it makes sense if you've got kids playing and stuff and they're outside, you don't want them to be screaming too much or whatever. So the neighbors don't get, you know, angry at you or whatever. But this thing was just, you know, crazy soundproof, which was pretty cool. Um, but 
man, that material was was super heavy. And uh, so, um, you know, we get there and, you know, he, he's he's in the construction business or he has worked in construction before. And I've done my fair share of construction projects myself. Yep. And then what we'll do is uh, we'll put some fancy stuff going up that way. But it's definitely going to be taller than the bank. That's for sure. We'll put another door here. Let's see. Bam. And then put some windows here. But uh, anyways, what we did was we um, we ended up uh, getting there, and then they were sort of tinkering around. He and his son were tinkering around with the um, you know with like these crowbars, and they 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 got some of the stuff off there. But uh, my friend and I were basically just you know there to get this done real quick and sort of get to the gym. So we basically. Uh, got it to the point where I was like, why don't we just push this thing over? And uh, that's what we ended up doing. And so, um, you know, we're, we're, we're tinkering around with it. And, you know, I, he takes out the, you know, supports in the middle, you know, which are usually about, see, they're supposed to, I think the legal is 16, but since it's a shed, I think it might, might be smaller than that. You know, they were, they were probably about a foot apart from each other. So he knocks out some of those and I start knocking out some of the, uh, you know, the panels and the drywall and all that stuff. And, uh, eventually it gets to the point where I'm just like, okay, we need to just stop tinkering on this. We could shove this thing over and, you know, cause it to actually, you know, collapse on itself and then, you know, be able to move on, you know, a little bit. So <laughs> we get on one side, I start, um, he starts kind of like pushing a little bit and I'm like, no, 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 you just gotta, you know, you gotta, you gotta get behind it. So, um, I was feeling a little bit frustrated that day you could say. And so I was just like, I let it all out. I let it all out. And I just shove this thing as hard as possible. Ooh, that looks like fun over there. And, uh, we just knocked it over and it just collapsed on itself. The roof was still intact. And then I just started tearing on the roof. I just started tearing it apart and oddly enough, I just started thinking, what would this look like in Minecraft? I kind of kept that idea to myself, but it was just kind of like, oh man, I play too much Minecraft. Or do I? You know, it's like, can you play too much Minecraft? I don't know. I don't know if that's even possible. So this is what I thought would look good with this. I mean, there's still sort of, you know, accessibility, but perhaps air conditioning for this kind of situation. And then, of course... You know, you'll have rooms all throughout here. And I think we will have windows on the side. And then again, a, probably a door back in that corner. As I jump down and break my legs. Um, probably right here. We'll have ourselves a little bit of a door. A back door. Let's see here. We go right there. And then perhaps... Oops. I don't want to go that far out. And then you got your bank there. So, yep. I think that's probably going to do it for me in this episode. I may work on this a little bit. May sort of get the... I'm going to, I'm going to put the floor down off camera. And I think I'm going to put in... You know, figure out some of these, uh, some of these rooms a little bit. And then uh, report back in the next episode. And again, we'll probably go mining in the next episode. So... We'll, uh, we'll do that, and uh, in the meantime, you know, thanks for watching. Leave those uh, likes if you liked what you saw today. Leave those comments. Again, I'm looking to see what you guys think of what else I should be putting in this little Wild West town. And, uh, of course, subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. Getting lots of subscribers lately, and you know what? That means more than anything to me right now is uh, getting those people on board and uh, enjoying what I've got here. So... This is JPT, and until next time, I'll be seeing you.